Welcome back to the Grand Solar Minimum channel. Today is Wednesday, June 26th, 2019. Our solar wind speeds are sitting at a 381.9 kilometers per second with a density of 7.1. Taking a look at our sun, yesterday we broke our 36 day streak of spotless days with two small sunspots. Well, today AR2742 has decayed. We still have a little bit of AR2743 hanging around. Sunspot number 12, we still remain with 109 days without sunspots. Our KP indices are sitting at a two and our 24 hour max is also sitting at a two. And looking at the SDO in motion, we will have solar wind flowing from the southern coronal hole that could graze Earth's magnetic field on June 26th. Noctilucent clouds invade the USA again. The proof was in the skies of the USA on June 24th when noctilucent clouds appeared at record low latitudes for the second time this month. Electric blue waves rip through Las Vegas, Joshua Tree and Pollock Pines, California, Salt Lake City, Utah, and Albuquerque, New Mexico. The American display followed with an equally extreme outburst over Europe on the night of the summer solstice. Noctilucent clouds aren't restricted to the Arctic anymore. Everyone everywhere should be alert for the next display. And now here's Mari. Thanks, Jake. We have another large plume into our atmosphere. The Uluwan volcano in New Britain, Papua New Guinea, had a major eruption of ash to at least 63,000 feet, that's 19 kilometers. The VAAC reports have been revising the ash column height upwards and may continue to increase. Satellite imagery shows a circular cloud over the volcano, indicating that this is most likely a full-scale Saplinian eruption, the world's first since Calbuco in Chile in 2015. Fortunately, an eruption alert was sent out yesterday. Evacuations have been taking place today. Please tune in to our live show tonight, 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We'll have more information on this volcano. We'll have world news, climate news, and GSM weather news. Thanks for tuning in to the Grand Solar Minimum channel. Please like and share.